Hello, welcome to my video about these hi-hat symbols here. I just wanted to give a little disclaimer here in the beginning. Uh, if your video appears to be paused, uh, it's not your computer whacking out or anything like that. Uh, it's simply that I wanted to give a disclaimer in the beginning here about uh, I'm just starting to get acclimated to this new piece of equipment, new to me at least. Uh, it's about a 10-year-old um, Hi-8 uh, Samsung camcorder reason why I'm using it is that it's a the audio quality is superior to a handheld uh, still digital camera uh, though it's uh, right now all I've got working is uh, mono I believe that's all the input will produce um, but um, just wanted to give that to you there and enjoy the video thanks bye bye um, folks uh, what we have here is a early 70s a Zildjian pair of hi-hats uh, someone has suggested that these are rock hi-hats. I was born in 71. I do not remember how they were marketing hi-hats back then. That weighed 1,200 grams each. This is, um, let me see how we focus here on that. It's pretty nice. Yes. Um, this is uh, heavily, uh, heavy patina here. And some of you may prefer that, so um, I'm leaving it on there, letting it be your option. And uh, I wonder if I have any. There we go. I wonder if we can get a good close up of. Uh, uh, right there. Wow, I wonder how well you can see that, folks. Yep, there is the okay, the autofocus working. That is the uh, stamp there, uh, early seventies, and the underbelly, quite a bit brighter as you can imagine. Still a little dirty, but like I said, leave them be, so you, it can be your option. Um, I'm going to turn down, I think uh, this may I don't know if that'll make a difference, but um, I am using a uh, Samsung um, 8mm camcorder, the uh, model SCL906 to be exact, trying to uh, eliminate the distortion of the mic, as I'm sure many of you can appreciate uh, so many videos we see on YouTube of um, uh, hi-hats and things like that, and especially drums that are distorted, that's pretty much useless. So, what we have here, like I said, this specifically is 1202 on the top, and 12, uh, 1210 on the bottom. And um, so you know, I'm using uh, Regal Tip 5As, which are nylon tipped. I believe nylon tip sounds uh, tips sound much better on cymbals than wood. So I'm gonna play along a little bit here for you. This is my first video I've ever made of a product I was selling on eBay. So wish me the best, and hopefully. This will help your consideration. Let me first get some of this going on. There's some some chick for you. Hey, uh, check out my video of some chicks. Thank you very much. I'll be here all day, all week. Yeah, thank you. Tip your waiters and waitresses. Yes, yeah. thank you. All right. can hear these are definitely high quality B20s. Alright. Uh, I play mostly with uh, on the tip of the hi-hat. Um, very rarely do I land on the edge. Uh, Though I will demo some demo some of that as well for all of you uh, uh, heavy metal guys out there.
for the metal guys. difference between the top and the bottom. I Instead of using words to uh, describe how they sound, I thought I'd make a video. Um, I think they are a bit on the darker, warmer side because of the patina and perhaps of their weight, uh, due to their weight. I do not have, I happen to have my new beats available to me right now. They're at a friend's house um, um, to compare. I wish I did, but um, I'm losing my perspective a little. So hopefully this video will help you in your consideration. Okay, considering it's been a long video already, my goodness, I guess I'll I'll sign off. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Happy bidding. <laughs>